Good morning children. Today we are going to learn chapter 14 time. A clock or a watch helps us to know the time. It has numbers 1 to 12 and 3 hands. See this is a clock. In this clock we shall see now here 3 hands. One is in blue color, red color and black one. Right. So this is short hand. Blue colored hand is short hand and this shows hours. See now. Able to see? Yeah. Now this red color hand is long hand. This shows minutes. And this is the black hand shows the seconds. This rotates continuously without stopping. Right. When the long hand is on 12, we read the time as o'clock. O'clock means full hour. Full hour. Now here see the time here. 1 o'clock. That means short hand is showing at pointing at 1 and this long hand is pointing at 12. So we are reading this time as 1 o'clock. Likewise here you see 2 o'clock. Short hand is pointing at 2 and long hand is pointing at 12. So we are reading this time as 2 o'clock. Likewise 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock. See here 6 o'clock. 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock and 12 o'clock. Now I am Ravi. I wake up at 6 o'clock. I eat breakfast at 8 o'clock. I go to school at 9 o'clock. I eat lunch at 12 o'clock. I return home at 3 o'clock. I return home at 3 o'clock. Now let us do it. Write the time shown in the given blocks. For example, here see short hand is pointing towards to 4 and long hand is pointing towards to 12. So this time we can read it as 4 o'clock. Now B bit you see now short hand is pointing at 7. And long hand is pointing at 12. Right. Now we read this time as 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock. Now C bit. Here 10 o'clock. D bit 3 o'clock. E bit 9 o'clock. F bit 8 o'clock. G bit 1 o'clock. H bit 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. And this is I bit 6 o'clock. J bit 2 o'clock. Now draw the hands on the clock to show your time for these activities and write the time. Round off to the nearest hour. I get up at, at what time you will get up? In the morning 6 o'clock. You go to school at? 9 o'clock. So you draw the short hand pointing to the 9 and long hand pointing to the 12. One I have done for you. You draw the time is for rest. I go to school at 9 o'clock. I come back home at 3 o'clock. I go to bed at 8 o'clock. My dad comes home at 9 o'clock. Now days and months. Days of the week. How many days are there in a week? There are 7 days in a week. They are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Right? See here. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Now come here. Months of the year we shall learn. How many months are there in a year? 12 months. There are 12 months in a year. What are they? They are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November and December. 
December. See, there are they are first month January, second month February, third month March, fourth month April, fifth month May, sixth month June, seventh month July, eighth month August, ninth month September, tenth month October. 11th month November, 12th month December, right? So these 12 months make one year. There are 365 days in a year. There are 365 days in a year. Now, let us do it. Circle the correct answer. Which day comes after Sunday? Monday. See, Thursday, Monday, Saturday. So, which will come after Sunday? Monday comes. So, circle this Monday. Now, which is the second day of the week? Monday. Sunday, Monday. Right? Now, which is the seventh day of the week? Saturday. See, if we count Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday is the seventh day of the week. Now, which is the sixth month of the year? June. Now you can check here back. See, sixth month is June. Right? Which is the first month of the year? January. Which month comes before January? December. Children's day in the month of which month it will come? November. So circle November. Thank you children. Take care. Stay safe.